All right, guys, welcome back. Let's talk about Anthony Smith versus Glover Teixeira, UFC Fight Night 173. Of course, this matchup is postponed, but let's talk about it anyway. Anthony Smith is 31 years old. He's six foot four with a 76 inch reach. He has a black belt in BJJ. He sports an MMA record of 32 wins, 14 losses. Glover Teixeira is 40 years old. He's six foot two with a 76 inch reach. He's a second degree black belt in BJJ. His MMA record is 30 wins, seven losses. So the matchup between these two, this is an interesting fight. It could be a passing of the torch from the old guard to the newer guard, or the old line could get it done once again. Glover is a big, powerful light heavyweight. He has pretty solid boxing, a crushing technical ground game. He is definitely more of a striker and seems to prefer standing and banging with people. Anthony Smith is very talented. He is a pretty big guy himself. He has well-rounded striking, power, is a finisher. He also has a ground game. I like this fight. Normally I would say for someone who is 40 years old like Glover, they are at a big disadvantage. But he's on a three fight win streak and kind of made a little resurgence. Smith in his last fight beat Alexander Gustafson, prior to that lost to top dog John Jones, and before that he was on a three fight win streak. This one's tricky for me because Glover has competed at a pretty high level for a long time. Seems to still have something in the tank. Teixeira on his game is very dangerous. He can clobber you unconscious or grind you on the ground. Smith is still in his prime, I think still coming into his own as a fighter, very impressive, skilled guy that knocks people dead himself. I'm going to play the statistics game here and say that Smith takes it. Glover's up there in age, he has a lot of fight mileage on him. I think Smith is a fresher fighter definitely. Not hungrier, fresher, because Glover still has fight in him, wants that belt even at 40. I'm thinking when this fight takes place, Smith is a little quicker than Glover, fights smart and on the outside as much as he can avoids the big shots and slowly wears Glover down. Possible KO? Who knows? Smith can't get cracked with anything big because Glover will be in it big time and anything can happen. We have seen Teixeira utilize his wrestling and wear people out for a sub win or TKO. If Smith gets hurt, Glover is going to be all over him and end it. I think Smith will fight smart, be faster, be a little better timing wise and reflexes, weather an early storm, and beat Glover. I can see a stoppage. Glover's so tough, it could go to the scorecards for Smith. I think this would be a stand-up fight. The BJJ and grappling might negate itself. But you guys let me know what you think in the comment section, who's going to win and why. Thanks for watching the video. If you enjoyed it, click subscribe, like, and share. Appreciate you guys. And until the next segment, take care.